Uh, we're a comprehensive cardiology service, and so we provide both outpatient and inpatient care for a wide array of cardiovascular conditions. It really spans a really wide spectrum to include preventative cardiology, um, it includes acute care, um, interventional cardiology, procedural uh, cardiology such as placement of cardiac devices, and invasive uh, testing. Hey, good to see you. Good to see you. How are you? Good. How are you? The specific screening test that we offer to appropriate patient is a coronary calcium scoring or a screening CT scan to detect calcium buildup in the heart arteries. And the second is a carotid intimal thick medial thickness ultrasound. It's a basic ultrasound of the carotid artery looking for early evidence of atherosclerosis or plaque buildup in those arteries. The benefit of having these types of tests is really in the right individual we can identify early markers of coronary heart disease or plaque built up in the heart arteries or early markers of plaque built up in the, in the carotid arteries that would change how we treat that individual. Um, as you know, um, we talked about in clinic, you have a couple of risk factors for having heart disease. For example, in our clinic, we had a 49-year-old active duty colonel who had a family history of heart disease. Given her family history, we sent her for a coronary calcium screening test to see if she had early evidence of heart disease. And indeed, she had uh, a very advanced degree of coronary calcification. And while she was asymptomatic, she had not yet had a heart attack, thank goodness, she had not yet needed any type of interventions for her heart. We were able to change her medical therapy and put her on an aspirin, put her on a cholesterol-lowering drug called a statin, and try to, and hopefully intervene and address her heart disease prior to her having an event. The patient did the cardiac CT scan that you referred uh, and as you suspected, you can see here he's got a very tight lesion. In the military, we're required to do a periodic health assessment at least every 12 months. During that assessment, the service members are queried about their use of tobacco products, their healthy living, exercise habits. A large percentage of patients, once they get over 40, should start very seriously thinking about ways to prevent future coronary heart disease. Never smoke. And if you do start, stop. Smoking cessation. Number two is Exercise, exercise, exercise. Vigorous exercise and lifestyle. Third is to know your cholesterol values and be aware of your cholesterol values and discuss those with your doctors. Number four is to know what your blood pressure is. And if you have high blood pressure, you should demand that that be treated just as aggressively as all the other things that, that we talk about. And then lastly, talk with your doctor about whether you are a candidate for a screening test to potentially identify early evidence of heart disease or vascular disease.